Hampshire, a little ski resort town, uh, very touristy. Uh, it's just starting to get dark. I don't know where I'm gonna sleep. Um, got my eye open for a school or a baseball field. I'm very hungry. And all I've had to eat in the last uh, two hours is beer. All right, I'm right downtown. Ooh, the sky is incredible. Uh, right downtown in Lincoln. Um, found a public school. This is like right in the middle of downtown, just right off the main drag, and it's set back. Uh, it just seems promising. What's down this way? It just gives me a good feeling. No trespassing under the 9 p.m., 6 a.m., under penalty of the law. <laughs> oh yes, we found it. Oh. I'll take it. Ooh, and a free sweater. Uh, oh yes. Here's another thing that <laughs> happened today. Uh, I climbed the <laughs> I climbed the summit, uh, King Kamenga's Pass, and um, the first guy. Uh, Tyler stopped on the road and gave me two beers um, and I carried them it was just near the top of the summit uh, and at the summit I met another cyclist going the other way I gave him one and then I went to the lookout point and I drank the other one so it was two beers and then when I was drinking the other one at the lookout point another guy Jose gave me this beer and then uh, I went down, there was a second lookout point halfway down the hill, uh, and then there were two other ladies, and then I drank, I drank home with them, and they gave me two more. So that's, um, and then they gave me some, uh, this is pumpkin bread, I think. Um, so, <laughs> from the top of the hill down the descent, which took like, I don't know, probably about 20 minutes of biking, uh, I'm, <laughs> I ended up with six beers and a, and a thing of, of uh, pumpkin bread. So I'm a little bit tipsy right now. It was a fun bike ride down the hill. Uh, big thanks to everyone that donated beer. Uh, I haven't been drinking in a long time. I've been trying to avoid the booze a little bit. and um, So the two that I had were more than enough. Oh, good morning. Another beautiful day. Today I'm finishing off <laughs> this bag of oats I bought in uh, Sydney, North Sydney, Nova Scotia. So it's been it's been at least a month I've been carrying this uh, kilogram of oats, and that's the last of it. I'll have to go and buy more today, I guess. <laughs> Constructed as part of the Franconia Notch Pathway, this path, completely separate from the parkway, traverses the length of Franconia Notch and provides access to all park facilities and natural features. It looks like it's paved. Paved and shady. I'm going to follow it.
Alright, in Franconia. Did a massive uh, 33 kilometers today. Took me a long time to get moving this morning. <laughs> I don't think I left Lincoln until about uh, 3 o'clock. And then I was up through Franconia State Park. Um, so big thanks to Ryan and Eli for the suggestion. I didn't, I couldn't seem to uh, cover any distance. I just kept stopping. There was uh, so much to look at. It was gorgeous. Beautiful mountains, streams, crystal clear water. Uh, really nice. And, and uh, a designated bike path to go with it. Uh, so that was a lot of fun. Met a lot of cool people out there on the trail. And got almost nowhere. Get my tent tucked away back there. I just got my first visit from the police. Um, you saw the smoke coming from the stove. It was only a little bit. I managed to keep it down pretty low. But he saw it. He was driving by. Turned around. Came back in. Uh, just check it out. He's like, ah, you're fine. So it's no problem. Cop doesn't care. It's fine. I don't care. 